in Milwaukee. We've got open-air baseball for you on the show. It's the San Francisco Giants and the Milwaukee Brewers. To get this one started after this. Just about ready to go. And starting in this one, Freddy Peralta. What do we need to know here about the right-hander? Try to stay back for that power changeup. Speed differential between the fastball and the changeup is Leading huge. Board, Hitters, they have a hard time the staying back. Ready to go? Lamont Here's Lamont Wade Jr. Jr. And the pitch. Swing and a foul over the screen and back out of play. Breaking ball inside, and it's one and one. On the play, and out number one on the grab. Here's the Giants lineup, and the key to victory for them here, get their start and run support early. Boog, if they can get him that run support early, it's likely the other team folds because they know how dominant he can be once he gets settled in. So put pressure on that other team right away. Jump out to a lead early and a few runs is going to feel like 30. Tyro Estrada, the next to hit, takes ball one. The wind of the pitch. On hammer, the pulled foul. One down, base is empty. A little out front there as he swings through it. Pitch misses, two and two. That one ran inside, almost got him. One out, base is empty. Up the middle, and it's through for a hit. That is third. The center Timing center. on the swing is good, able to shoot the ball up the middle. Didn't the square it up as much as he probably would have liked, but that's a good approach paying off. One down, runner at first. Here comes Mike Yastrzemski to the plate. That catches the top part of the zone. It's 0-1. Oh, oh. At the belt and fires. And fouled off. With two strikes, may see some movement over there at first base, trying to stay out of the double play right here. Line drive. And it's two down. That is good. The designated hitter, Jorge Soler. Jorge Soler up at the plate. Out to play very running anything over their heads. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at all. Well, strike one is so critical in a bat like this with a real threat at the plate looking to do damage. Comes up empty. A little anxious, a little aggressive early in the count. Too much for me. The pitch. Foul ball still 0-2. Just missed. If he's able to connect on that, look out. And he deals. Hacks and misses. It's a strikeout. So no runs here in a base hit, no errors, and one left. Now it's the Brewers' turn. It's a scoreless ball game. Back here at American Family Field. And on the mound in this one, Logan Webb. Great sinker. Although it's not his primary pitch, it's really that he can go to. Misses the barrel of the bat. Gets ground balls and lets the defense work behind him. Now a chance for Christian Yelich. 
the left fielder. Chris Yell it. The line to kick the pitch. That oh. misses the zone. And that Run is ball. ball. Right-hander deals. And now it's even up. Filthy changeup right there. Just pulled the string. Right-hander kicks deals. Pitcher in a little bit of a tough spot right away to start the no, inning, not where you want to be. So we'll see if he's able to work around it and pick the defense up. No outs, runner at first. And now it's William Contreras. First oh. offering and it just misses. Yelich on at first. Nobody out. Next offering is in for a strike. And another ball. Two strikes. Good approach right there. You want to get something just a little higher that you can elevate. Stay out of that double play. Three and that's in the dirt. Sal Fraley up next for the Brewers. That's Swings and misses. Struck him out. Couldn't hit the ball at the knees he came out of his mechanics the right there field. typically likes to yeah. shoot the ball the other way but that time a little anxious South right now for the Brewers in there at the knees comes a pitch one one. pitch out but no action man at first one away Webb checks the runner Yelich dives back in and the righty deals that one, one. one misses and it's two and one well with the can end up in the dirt a good secondary lead doesn't have to get away from the catcher but if you're anticipating based off the trajectory get yourself in the scoring okay. position ripped on a line calls it in two away batting four Let's take a look at the Brewers lineup. And the batter now is Reese Hoskins. That's in for a strike.
the pitch. That one down the line, and it goes just foul. Oh, and two now. Fights it off, you'll see another. Two outs. Swing and a miss. Scoreless after one. All set for the start of the inning. Michael Conforto will climb in. And the pitch. And ball one to the right fielder. There. Now 2 0. Oh. Definitely a swing and miss slider down pretty well. Just couldn't get him to offer at it. Kicks and deals. One. Man at second. Swing and a miss. Looked off balance that time. Big time jam right there. I hate it as a hitter, but standing in center field, you can't help but chuckle a little bit. Ball, another 2-2 upcoming. Right into the plate. That ball is foul, and the pressure is building. Righty delivers. Spoils that one, and it remains two and two. The pitch. And a swing and a miss. He battled for a long time, but it finishes with a strikeout. You can't be mad at yourself after an at-bat like that one. And here is Matt Chapman. That clips the corner. Here comes the 0-1. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. Man, he was really tight on that fastball. Great job of setting him up and throwing the curveball. Add some velocity to it on the next pitch. You can't catch up. And that just misses. Movement in Milwaukee's bullpen. Elvis Piguero appears to be getting loose. Clark getting cranked up as well. And run standing at second here at the top of the second. And another ball. That's the third. Fires over to Hoskins. Two up, two down at the top of the second. Austin Slater stands in. This to third, Monasterio. And he beats it. That's a hit. Great try there. Tough play and a nice backhand stop. Perfect exchange and throw to get the out. But it looked like he had to dig in there a little deeper, like he was trying to get a split finger grip or something. Close play, but that little extra time on the transfer made all the difference. So two outs with runners on the corners. Now it's the Giants catcher, Patrick Bailey. Slap the other way, foul. Solaire on third. Slater on at first with two down. Swing and a miss. And it's not even two. Fly ball lifted in the air right field. Fraley makes a nice running catch. Giants leave a couple. We'll go to the bottom of the second. No score.
back here in Milwaukee. Here's the shortstop at the play. Willie Adamas. And the right hater back to work. Pitch misses. And that's ball one. In the air, right field. He's got it. Tags up from second, and he'll head to third. Conforto whips it back in quickly, and the go-ahead run stops at third base. Very good. Making a move at third. Here's the Miller. Up now for the Brewers. You have to stay disciplined in these at-bats. Try not to chase. A strikeout here is the last thing you want. Swing and a miss. Strike one. Action in the San Francisco bullpen. Mason Black getting ready to go. Harrison, the lefty, warming up as well. The winning run at third. Bottom half of inning number two. Next offering. Two strikes. Clyde Washington with home play duties in this one. A little bit of a low zone boot from Clyde. Nothing crazy, though. Pitchers, they work consistently down around the knees and are able to command their off-speed stuff. Tend to have some pretty good success with him back there behind the plate. Got him! Huge strikeout there. Oh, that's a huge strikeout right there. Big second out. And they were playing the full court press, and he got the swing and miss. Keeps this one tied. This next at bat should be a lot of fun. Odds of wiggling out of this just went up considerably. Next for Milwaukee, Jackson Chorio. In there for a strike at the bottom of the zone. Two outs. Fought off fast. two and a good eye there it's a good take swings through it and that's a strikeout sometimes he wears the emotion on the sleeve but that's okay as long as he's getting results and right there thrilled with the punch out to get out of it Now into the game, Owen Miller. He takes over as the now new first baseman. Now Marco Luciano. Look for him to hit behind the runner, perhaps shoot it to the right side. The pitch. There's a strike. the zone and a count is 0-2. Well, he didn't like those first two pitches now in an 0-2 hole. He's going to have to battle. Hope he gets a mistake. And a pitch. Oh. The shortstop takes the ball. One ball. Two straight. down low to get him swinging now especially with how effective pitchers work up in the zone these days that's a devastating combination back to the top of the lineup so here's Wade now first time up was a pop out that's a bull foul one out the go ahead run is in we're here in the top half of inning number three. Fastball for a strike. Well, we call that keyhole. Even though it's right there and looks pretty good, if he doesn't love it, he's not going to swing that early in the count. 
That one just misses. Well, he's not afraid to fall into a two-strike count. Knows the strike zone very well, so much so that I think umpires will look at him and determine whether it's a ball or strike, if he swings or not. Man, it's second. And no one can get there. Around third. He scores and they have the lead. One and into second with one away. That's a double. Always feels good when you come through and get your team on the board first. Showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy, didn't try to pull the ball. He let it get deep, right to it, and then extended through the swing for the line drive base hit. Tyro Estrada. And he's already singled in this game. First pitch misses. What a no. Right-hander deals, and there's a foul ball. Wade leads off second with one gone in the inning. Next pitch in for a strike, and the count one and two. That's a little bit low. The punch out there. And two away now. Up next to the guy. Mike Yastrzemski up here. Mike Yastrzemski. Puts it in the air out towards left center. It gets down a base hit. The throw in. The tag and they put him down. In the play before the inning ends. So they get a couple of runs, not two hits, no errors, and no one left on. We head down to the home half of inning number three. It's the Giants two and the nothing. And we're back. This is Bryce Terang. Well, as a hitter, you don't want to be part of a team that was no hit. I mean, it's embarrassing, man. So this guy right here, he's looking to do anything he can in this leadoff at bat to make it tough. The pitch. Line drive. It in and there's one away. Andrew Monasterio up down for the Brewers. As a pitcher, you know the runner on second is ready to push things with his speed. A base hit's probably going to be a big run, so you really have to execute on the mound. Just missed. up an RBI. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the ball straight to it. That's great work right there. Here's Yelich at the dish. He's over one. Runner on the goal. Pitch in for a strike. Catch and throw guy behind the dish. Nice job right there, but he just beat it. A one run lead here in the last half of the third. There's a strike. Well, he's gotten ahead with two pitches down in the zone. He has plenty of options right here. He can go up, he can go away, he can add velocity, he can subtract. Good job to fight that one off. The 0-2. Backwood slider ties him up, struck him out. Oh, really went aggressive in with that slider. Good two-strike pitch right there. At worst-case scenario, it's a weak contact in play. Exactly where he and the catcher wanted it.
So last chance for the Brewers. William Contreras up now for the Brewers. Trying to deliver as the hero. Back close the corner. Go ball. One strike. Man on second, two down. Swings and lines, one towards the deck. No one can get there, it falls in. The run scores from second, it's 2-2. Two -two. And that's a two-out double. Such great concentration. Everybody on their feet, knowing that you can come through with a good swing. And there, he doesn't try to do too much. Runner at second, two down. Now it's the right fielder, Sal Fraley. 0 for 1 so far. To the right side. Fires yeah. over to first. They limit the damage here. They put two on the board with a couple of hits. No errors. And one left. On to inning number four. We are tied 2-2. To the fourth. Now it's the Jorge. man at second. Jorge. Nobody out. Chris certainly one of the things in his head is trying to get the runner over. Yeah, the way that we see the game played today, though, guys are not sacrificing as much to get that runner across. They're really looking at doing damage. There's one. Everyone appreciates when a shortstop makes a play like that. Your manager's smiling over there, and your teammates are loving it. Michael Conforto. He struck out swinging at his first And a good fastball to start him off. That's strike one. Trying to keep this a 2 2 game. Top half of inning number four. Next pitch is outside. the ground and it's just foul that was close kicks and fires good to lay off that pitch down and the 2-2 ground ball up the middle touches the bag for one and that's two three up three down for him there and midway in the fourth we are tied 2-2 And welcome back to the ballpark. Bottom four, leading off, the Owen Miller. The pitch. And that one clips the corner. There's the sinker at the knee. Tried to get him to chase on a slider down and away. Oh. And that's off the inside edge. And the count's even at two. Out to short. And no throw for some reason as he reaches first. That's got to be an error. Boom. Staying within his game right there. I mean, this gets the infield single, and now he's on base to possibly do some damage. I love seeing what guys like this can do to disrupt the game once they get in a position to do so. Adama, strike. strike one. The winning run standing at second. We're here at the bottom of the fourth. And a breaking ball drops in for a strike. Ooh. 
Line to left. And that's a fair ball. And win it 3-2. So exciting to see a team walk it off. Not so much fun if you're on the other side, but what a great way to win. This team is celebrating, and this win is well-deserved. A 3-2 final score in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon.